Hello! Today's video is sponsored by Helix Sleep. Helix Sleep. Helix Helix Sleep. Helix Sleep makes premium mattresses and bedding that are customized to fit your needs and conveniently shipped right to your door. Everybody's different and Helix knows that. So they made a sleep quiz that matches your unique body type and sleep preferences to the perfect mattress for you. It's all based on your different sleep positions and firmness preferences. They have something special for everyone's unique taste, and if you sleep with a partner, you can take the sleep quiz together and find something that's the perfect compromise for both of you. I'm a side sleeper who prefers a medium mattress, and I share the bed with my husband and two cats. Based on the results, Helix matched me with their Helix Midnight. I ended up upgrading my sleep by adding on their Glossiotex cooling cover since I'm a hot sleeper all year round. <laughs> I've had my Helix mattress for several years now and it's still holding up like day one. No indents or sagging areas and whenever I'm away from home, whether it's at a hotel or with family, I am so spoiled by how comfortable this mattress is that I actually find it pretty difficult to sleep on any other mattress. <laughs> This year, Helix launched their newest and most high-end collection yet, the Helix Elite Mattress. They put their years of extensive mattress expertise to use to create a truly elevated sleep experience. Helix delivers your mattress right to your door with free shipping in the US. It comes rolled up in a box and it's really easy to set up. If buying a new mattress makes you nervous, know that there's a 100 night sleep trial to test out the mattress and ensure that you love it. And Helix mattresses include a 10-year warranty, and they offer financing options and flexible payment plans. I love my Helix, and I think you would too. So if you're looking for a new bed, check out Helix Sleep. You can click the link below or go to helixsleep.com slash amyk to get 20% off your Helix mattress plus two free pillows. And with that, thank you so much to Helix for sponsoring me this video, and then let's get on to, 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 to it. Hey buddy! Hi! Sorry it took me so long. Um, oh, no. We don't play with these, remember? Ouch. No. Hurt. Ow. No touch. No touch. So, I'm sorry, I know that you don't like staying in the basement all day, but remember, it's because the bad people will take you away if they find you. Alright? You understand? So we have to keep you here. Safe. This place is safe. Okay? Now, I have some good news and I have some bad news. So, good news is that Trevor says that I can bring my cousin from Canada, from Canada, to the big party tonight. That's you. That's you, bud. So you get to meet all of my friends and all of the neighborhood kids and all of that. You're going to have so much fun. But the downside is that you're still an alien. And you don't exactly look human. But that's okay. That's the bad news, but we're going to fix that. All right? Now, I have this idea. If that's okay with you, you tell me. Now, this is liquid latex. It looks a lot like human skin when it's dried. I was thinking I would mold it over your face and then you'd look more human and then we wouldn't have to worry about dressing you up in seven coats and two hats to make sure that you look a certain way, right? So, what do you think? Anything for the party, right? Oh, I can tell you're so excited. I'm excited to introduce you. I've been talking up, you know, talking you up to all my friends about how awesome you are. I did tell them you were mute and that, you know, you're from Canada in the more rural parts. 
so if that you know if you do anything weird or inhuman that you know they're from Canada and not to make fun of you they're totally down don't worry about it and remember what we practiced remember good job great job that was almost that was almost right yes okay perfect all right I do want to start by prepping your skin a little bit so I don't really know how your skin may react so I want to clean it off a little to give it a bit of a, a base so that it looks a bit more um, human because uh, it's um, your skin is like bumpy uh, which is fine a lot of humans have bumpy skin I mean I myself I have bumpy skin but yours is like more so um so yes uh hold still this is just a basic cleanser and i'm going to use it to just get all over your face okay you want to feel it is that okay on your face right here good all right hold still there we go. It's not too cold or too hot or anything. Okay, good. There we go. Just want to all over your face. This one's great because. should be good. Um, so I do think I want to go in with another exfoliator just to um, smooth it out a little bit more. Um, it's still very gentle though. If you can see, it's just these little tiny sort of rubbery kind of things. It feels really nice actually. But it should be able to exfoliate better than the little brush I used. You want to feel it? Yeah, it's not too bad. It's nice. And I can put this on your face right here. Okay, good. All right. Let's do it.
human skin, we add a layer of some sort of wetness or oiliness between makeup or something like that so that it doesn't hurt the pores in our skin. I don't know if you have pores. Um, I don't, I don't know, I can't really tell. Um, I'm just going to assume that you do. So let's just put like an oil, um, it's called a primer, on your skin. Okay. Kind of like an oil. And it has that scent you really like. Remember? Oranges? Mmm, remember? Yeah, you love the scent. smell? Oh, no, we, we don't eat it. No, we don't. It's not. No. Okay, just on the face. Okay? Half on your face. Like this. Yes, we don't lick it. No. Okay, ready? I'm just going to should be good. And I think that your skin is ready for the liquid latex. I need to put some gloves on because it can be sticky. Sticky. Remember? Sticky. Sticky. Do you remember the sticky? Like the, yes, like the slime. Remember the, the slime that we bought? Yes, just like that. Sticky. Sticky. Until it dries and then it's not sticky anymore. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna roll up my sleeves a little bit. I don't want it to get stuck. Okay, here we go.
use that oil and I'm going to sort of mold it while it's still a little bit wet so as it dries I can make sure that it's in the, the, the shape that we want okay so I just, just want to smooth it out in this cheek area up on your forehead too just really smooth it out was a little flat like that yeah so we're just gonna give it a little bit of life just a little bit of life so that you look a little bit more full in the cheeks so that you look a bit more human in the T-zone. So, the sculpting looks pretty good, but there, it dried a little weird in a few parts. So I'm gonna need to use something to sort of, um, fine-tune it. Okay, so we'll do some fine-tuning. Okay. So, see, um, face faults, see this? You need that. Oh, no, um, don't open your, your mouth too wide. Smile like this. Practice. Good job. Very good. Our teeth are, hmm, other people, they, I understand, but other people may, okay, sorry, face folds. All right, you don't mind if I... Just really want to make... 
sure of that. Your smile looks very inviting. This part here also. Um, where else are there? Oh, um, like here. make sure that it blends really nicely into your smile lines. Okay. There are just a few pieces on the like edges of the latex be clipped. Clipped, clipped. They need to be clipped, clipped, clipped. Okay? Remember when you had your claws and I clipped them? I'll show you. Okay, see this? Remember? And it wasn't too bad. It was okay. Yeah. Good. There's just a little Right there, I need to clip. Is that okay? All right, I'm gonna get in right here. All right. Clip. See, that wasn't bad at all. It's okay. All right, another one right over here. Clip, clip. And up here. Clip, clip. Clip, clip, clip. And right here. Ready? one right there. All right. Clip, clip, clip. All right. That's okay. Right there. I'm going to come in. Clip, clip, clip. Good. Now let's get one right there. Ready? Ready? Clip, clip, clip. Very good. And just right in the center here. I know it's near your eye and it can be kind of difficult. Okay. Hold still. Just like a little smudge, like good. Okay, now um, I think we can move on. There's just one more um, wet thing. Um, so you still have a very gray skin tone like this color, right? And we want it to be like this one or like this one, right? 
Like, I have this, you have this. I fix that. Okay, I fix. Um, with this. And I have makeup. Just going to pat on your face. Yes, that's okay. Thumbs up. Good. Right. Good. Okay. I'm just gonna put some makeup on this thing here. Okay, one that is pretty light, but you know, you're from Canada and it's I, I think that they don't see the sun, maybe? Isn't that like Alaska, where they only see the sun like half the year or something? I don't know. I should have probably looked at my Canadian facts first. But, you know, if I don't know it, then they don't know it, trust me. Okay, hold still. All over. between the liquid latex, which is skin colored, and your gray skin. On the folds that I made. Be very delicate. Just very delicate. Good. Yeah. Next. Um, so Humans have... It's cold out. Brr. Really cold. You don't necessarily know this because your body seems to be completely fine with this temperature. Um, you're from Canada, right? So, um, it's gonna be a little weird that your cheeks aren't red, so I think we're just gonna pre- red your cheeks, um, more like a pink. So, this is called blush. Blush, blush. This is an older one. I'm sorry I didn't have any newer blushes, but it works just as well. Um, also, you're not supposed to share makeup. Um, well, I think it's okay if I share makeup with you, but you sharing with me so I think it's okay if I use this. Um, but this one is called Sugar Mama. Um, wow, that's an interesting name. I didn't know that. Okay, well, let's put some Sugar Mama on your cheeks. Um, I don't have a, a blush brush, so we're just going to use this, okay? Okay. Um, maybe 
just a little bit more down here. And a little bit. There. Okay. Um, you know what? I really should just probably go all out. I think that overdoing it is probably better. really good. Yeah, you look as if you've been outside, it's been a little chilly, and your cheeks are flushed. Yeah, I think I did well. You're looking pretty human right now, and I didn't even put the wig on yet, but that's on the way. Okay, so we are going to be partying all night long, um, which means that there's a chance that your makeup might melt off. So we're going to do our best to make sure this doesn't happen and set it with some powder, okay? So I do have a powder brush. Just gonna brush, brush off any excess here. Brush, 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 brush off any excess that we have here. So, I figured, um, because your skin color is grayish and very light, that blonde would work better for you. I stopped by this place called Party City. Party City. Party City. I figured you'd like that, since you were excited about the party. Um, and I got this wig for you. So, I'm going to put this head, like, so you can have this. Right? Yeah, it's okay, you can feel it. Yeah, exactly, that's what you are going to have. Right here. Oh, I'll show you, okay? Hold still, alright? So... There. Just like... That. Very good. See? Wow. You really do look a human. I mean, a little odd, but... Wow. We're gonna have so much fun at the party tonight. 
You want a hat? You can have my hat if you want. No, I don't mind. I know you like it. Yeah, go ahead. You can feel it. Let's go, okay. 